Hey everybody. Yeah, I wanted to come on here give you a bit of a update to let you know a little minor channel update before I clock in. Um, first of all, tomorrow I will be off on Friday, uh, which surprised even my second older sister when she called yesterday or well, last night. Uh, but I will be off tomorrow, as far as I know, unless things change. And the plan is to do another live stream. Now I already have my alarm here on my phone set for that occasion. And the plan basically is to turn on my computer when I get home. And because of the fact that I have it off right now for the rest of the day until I get back uh, for at least 12 hours, I'll be able to, you know, turn it, like I say, turn it back on, let it run for a bit, you know, load up, do its thing. And then what I'll do tomorrow morning, because I know I'm probably going to be asleep a little bit, um, is I'm going to hopefully get up in plenty of time and set up my live streaming for a live stream and a TGIF early morning, early Friday morning live stream. Um, long story short, um, I'm doing this because again, my mom is off and because she's off um, for the summer, it makes it a little harder to do as far as videos are concerned. Now, that's not necessarily true, I will say that, but you know, the only reason I get opportunities you know, sometimes throughout the days when I'm off and she's there, is because she's either on the phone with my sisters, either on the phone with a friend, um, or she's outside gardening or doing whatever, or she, like on Sunday, or this past Sunday I should say, is out in a, out at a event that has to deal, or has to do what I say with the upcoming wedding of my oldest nephew and his fiance, who's going to be my niece-in-law, basically. Uh, so. So yes, it's either any one of those kind of things. So uh, basically tomorrow morning, what I will do early, just as the sun's coming up, is try to do a live stream. Try to do a live stream. The only thing that might happen is I might do this around 6 or 6.30 because that's when, or even 7. I'll, I'll tell you this, I'll, I'll, I'll probably be doing something like this kind of like between six and seven because for some odd reason our cooler goes on because it you know goes on with the te house of the, te the, uh, the temperature of the house to cool it down so my mom usually gets up and turns that off and then goes back to bed so I might be doing this or what I'll do what I will do is I will set the um, is I'll get up turn off the light like my mom would do in the front in the in the living room area and uh, as well as the front porch as well as basically I might go up to the cooler and set that up for you know um, 83 degrees or so so it doesn't necessarily go off and wake her up so I so I'd have to do this but anyway besides that if I don't do that and I only like turn off the light and everything and I do this, that's basically meaning I'm being quiet because I don't want her, and I, and I say it with all due love and respect, I don't want her to wonder, okay, what am I up to, and kind of ask what am I doing, stuff like that. I'm not saying she would or anything because she's too tired to even, you know, realize what I'm doing, so, you know, that uh, gives me at least a, a little bit of peace of mind, but, you know, my mom, and I say it with all love and respect, as I've mentioned before, is kind of one of those parents or family figure family members if you will that's kind of nosy and I could tell honestly it's a, a trait that she inherited from my grandparents or her mom and dad if you will so I could tell you know that's something that she just inherited and I'm sure I'm not the only one that's dealing with it or has dealt with it my sisters she, she's lived with on occasions you know um, each at separate times has probably dealt with it so I, I know it's not something that's just coming out of the blue or just something that she decided she wants to do. It's something that she's inherited. And I'm sure she's done that when my mom and her, my, my dad and her, I should say, my dad and her were married and we were kids. She's done that before. As a matter of fact, a very infamous story, just to get this out of the way, is my dad used to have a rubber skull mask that he would wear for Halloween and he would put it right under the bed knowing, hey, that's the place I can get to it when I need it you know, for Halloween. 
Well, my mom basically said she had this nightmare of a skull figure coming after her. And the next day when my dad was at work, because she had that nightmare, she looked under the bed and there was the skull. There was the rubber skull. She, she threw it out much to my dad's, uh, um, I guess you can say annoyance or disapproval because she didn't contact him or anything and say, hey, I'm gonna throw out that skull mask of yours because you know I had a nightmare. She just went up and did it, you know. So it's something she's had with. So it's something she's inherited for, you know. For she's inherited and has had for a while. So, you know, it's just something that you know with me, you know, when I do my live streams early and let's say she gets up and either turns off the light or ups the cooler so that you know it doesn't go on as much until it's necessary. You know, that's why I do this. Well, that's why I'm kind of like quiet and I do this when I'm recording, you know, even in the evening, because even though she's relaxing or talking to my sister, I don't want her to be curious about what the heck I'm doing and asking stuff. And, you know, I just, I just work within that. I just work within that. I wouldn't say boundary, but within that, um, I guess you could say that region of, you know, just work with what you have basically basically adapt to what you have adapt to the environment that you have so that's what i'm doing and tomorrow will be no different it'll be no different even if i turn off the light it'll be no different but anyway back to the point of the video i'm just letting you know we're going to do a live stream tomorrow i'm going to let you strongly know that the live stream will be uh very basically very uh it, it's going to be a variety of things i'm just going to probably talk about a few things that come to mind some of my favorite stuff if you will you know, seeing as it's Friday. Um, and also what I'm gonna do is let you guys know, just like I did in the previous topics on my mind live stream I did yesterday morning, that right above is gonna be, cause I'm gonna be using OBS uh, Studio, but right above will be the um, sign saying, hey, this is uh, where you can donate instantly right away because uh, like I've mentioned before, financially I could use the help right now because of the fact that you know I've overdraft that is my fault and the fact that my money from daily pay that's an early like take out of my check I'm getting tomorrow and my check I'm getting next week um, basically is depleting my check to almost nothing so I do need some help in that department and it would be greatly appreciated if any of you guys that uh, tune in uh, tomorrow morning could um, help me out in that area instantly with Venmo and Cash App. It'd be greatly appreciated. Uh, but anyway, I just wanted to come on here and let you know that tomorrow morning we have a live stream coming. We do have a live stream coming tomorrow morning around the 6 o'clock um, a.m. hour. Just be on the lookout for that. And until next time, guys, I will talk to you all later. I got to get ready to get into work now. I work 115 to 6 today. So until then, take care, God bless. You know where to go to help donate. Venmo, Cash App, BW Roses 98 at Cash App and Brian Walmart 2 on, on Venmo. And the super thanks as well after the premiere of this video. Uh, but again, guys, just wanted to let you know about that. Um, I might be setting that up tonight too, so you can see that it's coming. And until then, talk to you later.